Spark Interactive Display Software allows you to work in four different application modes. In this video I will show you how to change the application mode within Spark and identify the key differences of each mode. The default mode for Spark is the Windows mode. As you can see it is designed to be similar to the operating mode of Windows. In this mode the main interface is made up of the menu bar, the toolbar and the writing area. The second usage mode is the frame mode which is commonly used for teaching and presenting. To switch to frame mode click on view on the menu bar and choose frame mode. As you can see common tools are now placed at the borders of the main interface to allow quick and easy access. In frame mode the main interface is divided into a number of parts. There is the main toolbar, the side toolbar, the pen bar, the menu bar, the default bar, writing area and the panes. As you can see the main toolbar is a floating toolbar and can be moved anywhere within the writing area. You can also click on the toolbar to minimize it and then expand it again. You can change the toolbar by clicking on the icons to move from the Start Tools to the Slide Tools tab to the Insert tab to the Pen Box tab to the Subject Tools tab. In the left and right hand corners on the frame mode there are two direction buttons. By clicking on these it switches the Slide Toolbar and the Pen Toolbar. This is particularly useful when teaching and presenting with Spark on large interactive displays. The next mode is the full screen mode, which is designed to maximize the writing area. This is useful for displaying teaching content on the entire screen when giving lessons in the classroom or presenting to a large audience. To select full screen mode, choose File, the menu bar, and select Full Screen Mode. This mode consists of a property browser, a writing area, and the floating toolbar. To change back to any of the other modes from the full screen mode, click on the file icon on the toolbar and select either window mode or frame mode. The windows mode, frame mode, and full screen mode are three different operating modes. During teaching or presenting, you may switch any of these operating modes to the desktop mode. In desktop mode, Spark then runs over the top of any other application, therefore allowing you to operate any application programs in Windows using the mouse. To switch to the desktop mode, click on the switch icon on the toolbar. When you do this, the Spark floating toolbar appears in the desktop interface of the operating system. You can also click on the same icon to switch the mode back to the Spark canvas. With the toolbar in the desktop interface and the mouse selected, you can use the mouse to activate any other application as you would normally. When you open a document or application, the Spark floating toolbar appears over the top. You can then use the pen or brush tool to write and annotate over the top of that document. In teaching, this is great for annotating and highlighting over the top of Word documents, Excel spreadsheets and PowerPoint presentations. When you have finished your annotations, if you click the switch icon again, a dialog box appears asking if you want to save the current annotations or not. If you click yes, this will add a new screen slide into Spark with all the current annotations saved. Thank you for watching. If you would like more information about Spark or G-Touch Interactive Displays, then please visit our website www.genieworld.com.
Preview.